here lads and lasses, it's Moscow here bringing you another vlog. So today's vlog is going to be all about the basics of sort of speaking Scottish. Not that I am going to try and instruct anybody on how to speak Scottish because I'm not a linguist or whatever they're called. But I thought I could help you out with some of the basics, maybe, potentially? Okay, this is how it goes guys, alright? What you want to do is you want to take your O's from words do and to and you want to can scrap them, all right? You wanna make sure that they are all gone. They don't need to be there anymore. Whilst you're doing that, your words end with an apostrophe N, apostrophe T. You wanna scrap that too, right? Take that apostrophe T and kick it out the window. It ain't gonna exist anymore. So that's things like your words like can't, didn't, isn't, shouldn't, wouldn't. Yeah, you get the point. You're taking the apostrophe T's away from all of those words and you're just shooing them away. And what we're going to do is we're going to replace all of this, the O's and the apostrophe and T's with a E. Makes no sense. But we're going to do it anyway. So your do becomes day, your to becomes t, your couldn't becomes couldn't, your didn't becomes didn't, your shouldn't becomes shouldn't, and your wouldn't becomes wouldn't. So <laughs> your sentences kind of go a wee bit like that. To tell you the truth, I wouldn't do them even if you paid me. That was probably a really mature example, but that's what Scotland does to you. I didn't get the point in that. Or here's a good one, Ken. Ken means you know, like you know. So let's just throw that at the end. I didn't ken. I didn't ken means I don't know. Or you can throw Ken at the end of a sentence and just hope for the best. But like uh, you can. But like this Ken. Just, you know, because fucking hashtag YOLO. Probably doing a good job of teaching you the basics here. And we don't want to care where you're from. We don't care where you're from. We want to know where you're fae, okay? F-A-E. That A-E is magical in Scotland. It appears at the end of almost every single thing we write. And I want to know where you're fae. Not where you're from, where you're fae. See this? I'm not holding my phone. No, 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 no. It's too easy. I'm hodding my phone. H-A-U-D. Hod. Hodding my phone. And, and see most? Like most of you guys? No, fuck that. You're not most, you're maced. Maced, M-A-I-S-T, maced. Maced-y you guys will understand what is happening in this video and maced-y as well, nae. Well, nae have a clue, you can. The phone is nae on my head. It's on my head, all right? And it's not even on my head, it's on my head, okay? H-E-I-D, heed, on, A-O-N, O-A-N. Can't spell my own Scottish, O-A-N. On my head, you can. I'm really pleased I caught that, that was really cool. Huh. I didn't normally do stuff like that in my videos, that's the coolest you're gonna see on this channel. And then when you're asking a question, it's no what, it's what. As in, what the fuck's my battery doing running out? I thought it says I had loads of charge left in it, but I clearly didn't. I? There are your basics. You can do whatever you want with that news. You can take it, you can fuck off, you can do whatever you want. But that is your basics of Scottish speak. So if you're new to my channel, click that subscribe button because I put up a new video every single week. Click the like button as well because it helps me out. And I will see you next week with another vlog. But until then, haste you back, guys. And speaking of haste you back, you can purchase a haste you back t-shirts on Redbubble by searching up Moscow Moon or by following the link in the video description below or at the end of this video if you're interested in purchasing one of our t-shirts. Haste you back, guys.